Okay, um, howdy folks. Uh, here's a new ice fishing rod and reel combo that I got. It's a Fraybril um, Ultralight. It's for one to four pound test. But anyways, what I'm gonna go over, I'm not gonna do review on the whole fishing rod or anything like that. All I'm gonna do is talk about how to switch switch over the bearing so that your reel will function for left to right hand. So basically you take off the cap like I just did look at the back you see there's a retainer clip in there so you just gently try to get that out okay there comes the retainer clip now there's one more piece in there it's silver and that's a that's a clutch bearing pop that out there it goes okay so here's your here's your clutch bearing basically this bearing just spins one way or the other it can only spin one way it'll spin one way or it'll grab the other so basically when you're reeling in When you're reeling in, your, your spool's moving on it and making it move this way. But as soon as a fish grabs it, you're gonna, it's going to actuate your, it's going to grip that and it's going to actuate your, your drag system. So basically, you'll know when you want to set up your fishing reel for the right hand that you are, you will be reeling in forward this way. So if you put this little bearing on that, on that and you spin forward and it moves freely with no hesitation, you know you're right because the way that the fishing rod is designed is the eyes are at the bottom you're reeling forward you string your line on and you reel and you run it in so if you pulled down the line you'd have your drag system work and it's actuating so there you go simple easy way to do it put your reel back together if it's still not working right then you might have done this step wrong so you just take it apart again have your little bear make sure to that when you take it apart you have your bearing come out the way that it was then you just flip it this way, put it back on, and now the bearing will move perfectly smooth that way, opposite. So what you do is you take your seats, your, your reel seat clips off, or slide them forward so you can take your reel off, then you flip your whole reel that way, and that will give you left or right hand operation with the proper draw, uh, uh, drag functioning on your reel. See where it's very important to have a good drag on your your ice fishing rod when you're when you're battling big northern pike and stuff like that because you know you can sit there and fight them for a while especially on an ultralight combo setup that's only got four pound test on it so um what else can i tell you about this uh if you like that video hopefully that explains how to switch over from left hand to right hand on these reels it all it also will be um the same same procedure for a fly reel